The biggest feature of web is links. You can link various documents on the web using an anchor tag. You can also link uh, non-HTML documents like PDFs, images, etc. Now in our document here, you can see that there's a link here, but it's not clickable. If you click on it, it doesn't take you anywhere. The biggest feature of a link is it takes you somewhere, whichever is given you by the URL. Now let's make it a uh, link, actual link that takes us to the Gutenberg by giving an anchor tag. That's done by giving an A tag, anchor tag. A H R E F is an attribute which takes the URL of where we want to it to take us and then end it by A. And within this, we'll give a text uh, what should be shown to the user, right? Uh, let's it be Project Gutenberg. And I save it and refresh it. You can see that it is linking to uh, Project Gutenberg to the link. In the footer of the browser here, you can see that it's showing the link where it leads to. Now, if I click on this, it takes me to that page, but it takes me in the same window. That's because I'm not given a target as to which window it should use to open this link. Now I can give a target as blank so that it opens in a new window. Now I'm going to save this and refresh this and click on this. Now you can see it opens in a new window. There are other options for target. You can look. Now here we are given the complete URL of the resource of, of the HTML document that we want to link to. But you can also give relative path. If you see um, my folder structure, I have my first .html which we were exploring and in the same folder there is next.html. So we can link to this next.html uh, from our document just by using the file name because it's in the same folder. So let's do that next dot html end it by slash a and say next and then save it refresh it you can see the next link has come and you click on it it goes to next dot html which doesn't have much but you can see that it's in the same folder path locally and this is how you used to link uh, local folders using relative path. You can also, uh, you know, go to a folder, subfolder, etc., etc., just like how you do it on a file system. Now, you can also use anchor tags to link within an HTML document to a separate paragraph, to a separate section within the same document, up or down. Uh, just explore the web and see how you can do that. That's an exercise. Thank you.